Yo, what up? It's your boy Wiz Khalifa, man. I'm right here on Playboy.com for my 20 questions. If I could be any celebrity musician, just for the clothes from any era, it would have to be Jimi Hendrix. I love his style. It just seemed like the pieces that he would get were so unique and they were definitely inspired by women. So that's why I would rock with Jimi. Um, I'll pick one tattoo right here. It's my Uncle Calvin. It's a moon, because that was his nickname. He had a bald head and his name was his nickname was Moon. So it's rest in peace for my Uncle Calvin. I could like Levi's just because older cuts and, and fits, they don't really exist anymore. So I usually get them and cut them up or rip them up or do what I want to with them and make them mine. And nobody knows that they're Levi's. And I just like, I, I like the brand because it, um, it's just dependable, you know what I mean? It make great jeans and always have and always will. And yeah, I'm a Levi guy. Huh. Yeah, I get in a little bit of trouble. Well, I got in trouble before when I took weed on tour, but now everybody just smiles and lets me do my thing. My first experience taking a dab was probably like three years ago, maybe. And I liked it, it was cool, it made me super stoned. But I definitely like smoking pot, you know, the actual flower better. Maybe I'm old school, but you know, shout out to all the dabbers out there. My first Playboy experience, probably just like watching TV in the 90s, you would always see like chicks with huge tits and then you would know that that was like a Playboy model or something like that. And then the older that I got, it was like, started to understand what it really was. But yeah, just watching TV growing up in the 90s, looking at boobs. <laughs> in many ways, like, let me know that it was okay to be myself. Well, I mean, they're, they're both real geniuses. But uh, Steven been different before it was cool to be different. He's always been an individual. He sees the world through different 